So hello guys, today I'm going to show you a quick guide of how to use the ship QG version 3, the new version. So this one is I've gotten a new features. So I'm going to demonstrate to you how you can use that. First, when you download the add-on, it will come like this ship QG version 3 extract phase. So we have to do to extract it to this folder and I'm going to open it. So you will find this three files, animation to Python file and easy file. I'm going to copy the address as test. Let's go to Blender, edit, preference and install. So I'm going to paste it here. So the first thing is double click on the shape changing the zip file. It will go and extract it. Next thing, click on install again and click on animation to Python file. And then let's enable this. It will appear on animation to bar here. Okay, so this is register face object and machine to next shape key. So I'm going to explain how to use all this. The first thing you have to do is to select your character rig. Okay, so you can see this rig is called rig. You can see the name here. So select the character rig, click on rename, and you can see the name of your character rig is going to change to our shape keys, and the target rig is going to automatically pick that one. So the next thing you are going to do. Is, is to check your source rig. It's a source rig auto rig, then choose auto rig. If your character was rig with metal rig, choose metal rig. So this one I use auto rig. So I'm going to register my face object. So face object is all the facial features like the body, okay, because the body is holding the face. Okay, so I'm going to hide that one. I'm going to register the left eye, the right eye. I'm going to unhide everything. Now, the next thing is I'm going to select the rig and click on transfer animation and hit OK. Now we get all this keyframe here and when you play, you can see your character is doing this kind of animation. This and we have keyframes over our timeline. We are going to convert this into shape keys, right? For the old versions, you need to save it as shape key by yourself. This is time consuming. So this new feature. We have generate shape keys. It's going to generate the shape keys for you. We just click on it. So let's go to face frame and click on generate shape keys. Let's select that. We can go shape keys. You can see we don't have any shape keys uh, on this here. So once we click on generate shape keys, let's wait for Blender to do the calculations. Now we have generated this shape keys here. This is not Arcade. It's not using the Arcade name. So to make it Arcade. You need to click click on make arcade and you can see all the name are going to change to arcade benches. Now you can select the rig and clean rig. So this is going to delete all the animation from it. Now when I select the character body, I can use this one to make eye blink. Okay, and jaw open. So you can see the jaw is not open. The strength of opening the jaw is very low, and the blink. You can see. Let me search for the blink. You can see the blink. The eye is not closed anywhere. So I'm going to show you. You're going to use the blend sliders to face all this. So okay. So let me use the and uh, the eye blink. So first, I'm going to set the mouse value to maybe two, and let's increase this so the eye blink close well. And in this one is scraping to the eye, so we are going to use the scope to face that. So let's say uh, value 1.5 is good. So I'm going to copy this. Okay. After I copy this, I'm going to set this to zero. Set this, and all the shape key is going to reset. Okay. Now I'm going to paste the value 1.5 here and set values. After I set these values, all the mass value for the shape keys in this collections, all the objects. In this collection shape keys is going to have a mass value of 1.5 1.5 you can see now if i set the jaw open you can see the strength of opening the jaw is high the same thing happened to the uh, the teeth and the tank all of them is going to have this mass value. now we are going to normalize this okay we want to have you want to make the 1.5 to be normalized to become one so that you are going to create a shape key for mixed key so i don't know how to explain it but let me set this value back to one zero zero is so so that's all now after this you have set your value and you think 1.5 is good for you click on normalize shape keys done and then click on remove and map shape keys again okay this one nice that's all now when i select the character body and i search for jaw open you can see 
your jaw open one but you can see the volume is higher than before and the teeth too it's open high okay so we can use this one to make uh, the strength of the eye open or the other open so much the same thing to the blink so to search I can see the eye blink red okay so I'm going to reset everything I can set this one to zero reset set back to one set okay so the next thing is I'm going to search for the blink and face the clipping of the eyeball so I'm going to set the value to one select the body okay and set the value to one so for this let's go to scope to move and use the smooth to decrease the strength change for grab and I'm going to this one out and smooth it okay so now we have a nice eye blinking you can see it's still clipping here because of the subdivision i set to zero if i set to one uh, you can see everything will look clean here so because i want this thing to run smooth that's why i set to zero so let's go back to object now we are done okay so now just simple we are done generating the shape for our character here so here i'm going to show you how we can connect this to uh artificial mockup this okay so if you i'll show you the I will give the link to this on the description. Okay, so if you download this, the software is free. So go to open. If you download any store and open it, go to open advanced settings. And here I'm going to choose software name Blender. Okay, and a version 3x. Okay, and this neutral. So I'm going to copy this neutral name and I'm going to select the body here and I'm going to paste. The body the neutral to the body okay so this is going to be the neutral one after this when i this i don't come along with the this software okay so what we have to do is i'm going to connect it to this so we need to have iphone okay and then if you have the iphone and you download the app called official mockup tracking it's also a free one come here and type it on here okay so we have let's go. Okay, so it has connected now you can see it has connected only the eyes and so i'm going to show you how you can connect all the teeth and other part okay so for this i'm going to use I don't call driver's control that one's also free i will leave link in the description so okay call shaking driver's control so i will enable this go to animation and it will found here okay so first you need to register your master object okay and to register this the one called neutral and press a select everything add them okay and click on drivers call it shaking name click drivers that's all Okay, let's see if I have this one in here. So I want to connect them again. Hello. Hello. Because of uh we have simplified 